Hello, best friend, and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. Oh, okay. Not me entering my dancer era, but you guys know I used to be a dancer. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'll tell you about that another day, but yes, I used to be a dancer. Um, Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Sebastian, and I spill pop culture tea every single day. So if you're looking for a new messy best friend, you have found me. Grab a snack and a drink. Hit that subscribe button. I would be very grateful, you guys. Listen, we have to talk about Kim Kardashian because, girl, <clears throat> hi, I'm Kim Kardashian. No, I can't do her voice, but I feel like I could do Courtney's voice. Okay, it's ready? Okay. <clears throat> hey, Kim, you're just so embarrassing. Hey, Travis, Travis, do you want to get some matcha? I don't know. Do I feel like I slay that? Do I slay that bitch? Let me know in the comments. Um, okay, listen. Listen, we have to talk about Kanye West, his new wife, and Kim Kardashian. The new wife, girl, listen. I'm gonna put some pictures up here, girl. I'm not listen, I'm no one to judge, bitch. I am not fashion police. Uh, 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 of course, you know, I, I I'm no one to judge anyone, but girl, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? I don't know what the fuck this is, girl. This is giving very much you know, hocus pocus, you know, fucking Wednesday Adams, you know, I'll dance, dance, dance with my hands. Like, I don't know what the fuck this is, bitch, but if two plus two is four and five plus five is 10 and my titties are big and nice and squishy, what the fuck is this? Okay, I don't get it. So there's a new um, uh, head rumor going, well, it's like an insider allegedly headline going around that allegedly Kim Kardashian is incredibly jealous of this new relationship that uh, Northwest has with her new stepmama. So let's read the article, shall we? So it says here, sources reveal that Kardashian, Kim, is not thrilled about the budding relationship between her daughter and the architectural designer as well as, well as Sensory's bond with her other children. What the fuck is what? Oh, I oh okay, girl. The wife's name is Sensory, I guess. Girl, hang on. Let me let me just you know I like to give my facts straight. Okay, so Kanye West wife. Oh no, Kanye West wife is oh her name is Bianca Sensory. Girl, that was her last name, bitch. I thought that was her first name. You know what? It would have been a real good first name with, with how she dresses and stuff. I, w I would have believed that her name was Sensuri, okay? But Bianca, that's her name, okay. So it says here, according to an insider, Kardashian, who shares four children with West, feels uncomfortable with Bianca's increasing proximity to North. The source states that Kardashian is definitely jealous of the new woman in her ex-husband's life, and she has concerns about the nature of their connection. However, it seems that the nine-year-old, well, she's 10 now, uh, North holds a different perspective. In the eyes of the young girl, Bianca is super cool. A fact that apparently bothers Kardashian and gets under her skin. The strained relationship between Kim and Bianca is nothing new. Pre <clears throat> Previous reports have highlighted Kardashian's dislike for Bianca, with insiders noting that Bianca has gone to great lengths to emulate Kardashian's appearance. The situation becomes even more complicated as North and Bianca reportedly tied the knot. Girl, what? Oh, girl, not North, because it said West. <coughs> Kanye and, and Bianca reportedly tied the knot in a private ceremony, further complicating the co-parenting dynamic between uh, Kim and Kanye. Listen, first of all, okay, this is not your normal, like, you know, parent trap, stepdad, stepmom, you know, type of thing, bitch. You know, this is, this is Kanye West, girl, right? You know, and, and, and Kardashian, because, girl, they're all a mess, okay? Kim, Kanye, Chris, you know, all of these people, girl, they're, they're all messes, right? But Kanye takes it to the next extreme, bitch, okay? And Bianca, now I don't want to judge a book by its cover, but you know, she's very um, eccentric. I'll use that word, girl. She's eccentric, okay? And I don't judge, bitch. Go, you do, you, you, you got to dress however you want, boo. That's fine with me. But, right, I feel like maybe Kim, you know, Kim definitely, you know, because I've seen the Kardashians some from what I gather, 
Kim tries to give her children, you know, the best of the best, right? And everything is so aesthetically perfect. So I feel like Kim Kardashian tries very hard to have like a picture perfect type of lifestyle for her children that I think she fears when North goes to the West Sensory's house because, you know, she's like, God knows what, what she's gonna see there, right? And of course they have such a strained relationship that it's not like they can like, you know, pick up the phone and talk and, you know, you know, say, girl, what are you doing? Hey, Kanye, hi, Kim. You know, what's Bianca doing? What's she cooking tonight? Like they don't have that type of relationship. So of course it, it, it um, you know, it builds up a lot more drama and it just builds up a lot more stress. And <clears throat> you don't have any control because when it's Kanye's West time with the children, Kim has no control what goes on there what they see, what they hear, what they witness, you know, it's the same thing Kanye when they're with, with Kim, right? And the Kardashians. But I would think that <clears throat> life is maybe a little bit more normal with the Kardashians. That's just my my opinion, right? And that's saying a lot. Um, North, for a 10 year old, and from what I've seen like on TikTok and you know, on the show, she's a very, very grown 10 year old. Like at 10 years old, I don't think at 10 years old, I could carry a conversation like Northwest. Like Northwest, I, I mean, I was shocked. When I um, I saw her on TikTok a lot, I, I thought she was like 13 years old. The way she, you know, she's still very young-like, but she's also very kind of mature for her age. She knows how to, how to do her hair perfectly. She knows how to, she cooks pasta. Like she, you know, and she really does, you know, carry a conversation well so you know i i feel like she's a very mature you know 10 year old and i think kim is very aware of that so she's maybe a little bit scared of what north can pick up from you know over there having you know sharing custody you know it's very difficult you know luckily i never i never i never really kind of witnessed that um my mom and my dad uh he left us when when I was two months years old, or two months old. And then my mom had, you know, got a step, I married my stepdad when I was 13. Um, so, you know, I, I didn't really deal with like my real father side of it, but I did, I did deal with like my stepfather and that was a journey on its own, right? May he rest in peace. But, um, so I can't, I, I can't really know how that like dynamic goes of that, you know, waiting in the parking lot for, you know, it's your weekend with the, the the kids, but I did witness that with a couple friends and that, and I can't, I mean, it it is, from what I've seen, and you know, we're just normal people, it was very, very, very like, um, uh, tough on, on, on kids' mental health, you know? So add on millions and billions of dollars, add on fame, add on eccentric Kanye, add on the Kardashians, I mean, Damn, you know, I can't imagine, like, I would see my friends and how they would come back from the weekend with their dad and then the weekend with them, like, they would be messed up. So I can't imagine adding all of that other stress that comes along with co-parenting, but then add all of the Kardashian Kanye thing, right? It must be real tough. So all I do have to say is from what I have witnessed of Northwest, that girl, she's going places. Like, I, I can tell you. Um... But I just think that this life that these kids live is just so weird, you know? It's so out of the normal. It's not even Princess Diaries because, you know, she, uh, she found out, she, you know, she was a princess uh, when, you know, she was like turning 15 or something, you know? Damn, you know? Or like, I don't know, but you know, but damn, you know, it must be really, really tough. And then add that your father is Kanye West and your mother is Kim Kardashian and then add Bianca Sensory. Girl, Northwest, honey, damn and i mean there's a you know three other children or, or is it yeah it's four children i think in total i don't know you guys what do you think um i think kim kardashian definitely um i think it's that kind of loss of control i think kim likes to be in control a lot and i think that when she has to send north or her children to the other house with connie and and bianca i think she loses that so i think maybe that's where the jealousy is coming and then of course the bonding of it all I think that it's, I think as long as Bianca is teaching North good, good things, good manners and good, 
good morals and and you know you know i mean one thing is how you dress and how you act in public but another is when you're inside you know closed doors you know maybe bianca's like an exceptional woman maybe maybe you know kanye west this is just a character you know what i mean we don't know because we don't know them personally but i think of course that kim is very concerned because she loses control and she doesn't have a relationship. So she, you know, probably like assistants and bodyguards are handling the switch off, you know? So it can be very, you know, difficult. And I, I, I do think that if North is with Bianca and, you know, she likes Bianca and she's only seeing good things, then I think Kim needs to calm down. But of course I understand Kim because I'd be very terrified of sending my daughter to what I, if what I see in, in paparazzi pictures and then send my daughter there girl no mm -mm. sorry bitch but anyways what do you guys think let me know in the comments below i love you all so much thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys girl my superman bitch and i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye